Okay, so here we are ready to add some silicone in here and hopefully make the uh, endoskull fit in there. And now I didn't need to cut this guy off after all, but uh, I started grinding a lot on this guy uh, for it to fit. Now if you notice, I took out the eye. Uh, I figured maybe I'll make the eye separate. Uh, that way I can uh, put the light bulb in there and hopefully I'll figure that one out when the time comes. So the plan is to mix some silicone, put it in here, put this in here like that, put the silicone in there, and hopefully it will mold to it, have to position it right, and we'll let it dry uh, for about maybe an hour or so. But uh, I'll show you the process of the mixing of the silicone. I'm actually using uh, Platsil gel number 10, that's what it's called, Platsil gel number 10. And uh, it comes in two parts, A and B. You have A and you have B, and as you can see it's actually the same color. Uh, and I would be mi mixing this in a cup and adding a little bit of uh, red tone to it um, to mix it up and that way it isn't clear but it'll give me at least some kind of uh, uh, red, reddish tone under it and that way it will help me out to uh, you know make it look m little by little red blood whatever so here we have I poured it in there don't have much time with this stuff but uh, maybe just a dot of the red dye just uh, you don't need that much I don't really need it super red We have to make sure it's nice and mixed. Now I will have to be careful with this because I don't want this going on to the uh, area that I don't want it to go to. I mean, if it lands on the hair, I mean, it's going to be a big mess and I don't want to ruin that. Okay, again, this is Platsil Gel number 10. Put a little bit of dye in there. And pour it in here now you know I may be kind of relaxed right now but I'm actually crossing my fingers I don't mess up because if this messes up that's it it's history I don't know if you can hear a dog barking, sorry about that. I'm going to add just a little bit more. Now I'm not using latex gloves because latex will inhibit the silicone and it won't dry at all. I should have got myself some... Uh... Whoa, got to be careful here. Some vinyl gloves. Those would work good for silicone. And then again, I have been touching this maquette with uh, the latex glove, so I'm hoping I didn't, uh, you know. Well, we'll find out once I. If this thing doesn't dry, then that's the reason. Whoa. Okay, so. I need to position it, position here. Okay, I think that's perfect. I hope. Now, 
since I have a little bit of this here, whoop. I'm going to add a little bit more in here before it dries. I could always cut away. See, this will not stick to uh, to the resin, but it will stick to the silicone. And right now, I'm just trying to make fill in the gaps and make a uh, you know, like if it's a skin in there. Now up here, I didn't really want too much hair taken out. Oops, you know, like all this. I, I don't like that. I mean, I wasn't planning on that, but it uh, it came off. And I think, you know, I mean, like I said at the beginning, I don't want him to look like he has a mohawk. So right now, I'm not sure how I'm gonna fix that up. But uh, the plan is to maybe punch in some hair. The thing is, this is very fine needlework that they use. It's not your typical needle. So, being that it's in the area that that's going to be, you know, messed up, then you know, may may not matter if it uh, if it's a little bit bigger, because you'll have a lot of, you know, blood and and burnt looking tissue there which will, should work out good there we go like I said it's kinda scary because if I mess up it's not good, not good Got it. I hope the silicone is starting to thicken up, but it won't be dry to about another hour or two. And of course, this this is not done. I mean, the the, the thing here is I just want this positioned correctly. And when it is completely dry, my plan is to take this guy out so that we can put it in and put it out. But, uh, did I say put it in and put it out? Okay, take take it out. Okay. Okay, so, there it is. Video 5, I think. So... It's coming along. Once this dries, well, you know, I'll uh, continue. As I said, I am continuing working on this, even though I'm not recording it because it would be too long. Okay, guys, then we will see you next time.